Hey guys, welcome back to my Lakers, my GM. We are in the playoffs. My last episode, I did say we are going to be playing each and every single elimination game. See how well that works out. Unless we're down by like three to three to zero, oh, and then we win that somehow. I'm not. I don't. I don't feel like playing. And if if even if, 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 if I can't get words out, I'm so excited right now. Like I said in my last video as well. One more sleep until Halo Five. Like that's all I've been thinking about. Also the playoffs, but. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna simulate game. See what happens. We win that one. Kelly Uber has been complaining. What is he complaining about? Uh, playing time. How much minutes is Kelly Uber getting played? I think he's getting played six minutes. That's that's. I mean, that's more than the recommended minutes. He's recommended to get zero. So <laughs> we'll keep his minutes as is. Simulate the game. The Rockets win that one. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ooh. ooh. I thought I thought that first game. All right, as long as we keep trading, we're good. Uh, Kelly Ubri's voice is concerned. No comment. Kelly Ubri, this is not the time to be voicing your opinion on your playing time, good sir. I think we might have to pep talk Kelly Ubri again. Just, just no, no, never mind. Uh, he's fine actually. Uh, Bismack Biyombo, his morale, however, is not that great. So this might be a do or die situation here. And it is. We have a chance to close out the Rockets. An elimination game has occurred 3-2 against the Houston Rockets. This is a great opportunity to get out of the first round for the first time in my MyGM series. First time in the playoffs. First time just getting out of the first round in my MyGM series. It's, it's, it would be a great experience if we could do that. So let's, let's try to do that. Clippers. I saw the Clippers moved on. Beat the Suns. So let's try to try to put this away and uh, advance on and meet our bitter rivals, the Los Angeles Clippers. Here we go. That was really nice. Dwight and Embiid, this is going to be a nice matchup. This whole matchup in general is going to be nice. You know, old, old versus new. James Harden versus Kobe. Embiid versus Howard. This is really going to be a fun and interesting matchup. Can't wait to see how this one game, hopefully we win this game, like I've been saying. I want to close out. I want to advance to the second round. And uh, ooh, we gave Dwight Howard that. Tried blocking uh, Ty Lawson, but it just ended up in a free open bucket for Dwight. Here we go. Oh, once Eunice is sleeping. Dwight getting posterized in the second play. Playoffs. This is my first time ever seeing this little animation screen. It's nice to see. You know, the little things. The little things that matter. See Kobe. He's hot. So he better make that open three. Kobe has a tendency in missing open threes for my team. Kobe with a nice three for three from the field. I like that. Seven points. He's having an okay game. He he's he likes the playoff atmosphere. He hasn't been here in a couple of years. So hopefully we do well for Kobe. For Kobe's sake, you know. Looks like he may have another from what we've heard, there's a there's a fifty fifty chance that he's gonna be signing back with his team, whether he wants to try testing free agency or hopefully retires. It's just I said in my last episode, I don't think we're ever going to be the team that I envisioned it until Kobe is off this team. And I think he's going to be lingering around this team longer than we'd like because we heard in the, the press conference that Kobe might test uh, not picking up his player option or something like that. I don't even know he had a player option or team option. He has something option. And I don't think he's going to retire just yet, especially now that we made the playoffs. He, I don't think he will. Randall, oh my goodness, Randall, giving Larry Nance some time in the playoffs, you know, get his feet wet, Kaminsky for three, it's a good look, it's a very good look by Kaminsky, if that was Ryan Anderson though, he'd probably miss, Ryan Anderson was just like a failed project with this Lakers team, I was really hoping for him to pan out, because then we wouldn't have to make a single trade in season two, and I like that, I think my Milwaukee Bucks, my GM, I did in 2K15, there was a season where I didn't do a single trade because I felt like my team was good enough, and it was. And that's why I was kind of hoping I wouldn't have to trade away anybody this season, but unfortunately I did. And, uh, well, 
hopefully it pans out for the best of us. We get a, a cheaper salary and I think a more athletic, more potential player in Ben McLemore. Here we go off in transition. Can Larry Nance pull it off? Larry Nance. This guy. I now know this guy has the hops because of what I saw him do to Festus Azili in preseason. That was absolutely ridiculous. So, I think I've just been using Larry Nance wrong the entire first season and even second season because I thought he was a stretch four and he's not really that great of a shooter in 2K. He might be a better shooter in real life, but at least in 2K, his game does not translate very well. So, I think now I know what to do. Give him the lobs and... Uh, make him drive because as of right now it seems to be working we've been holding on to this lead it, it was a lot bigger in the first and second but surprisingly we've been holding on to the lead with bench players Larry Nance is I think this might be his game I think I finally I, I, I don't want to say I finally figured out his game but every every guy on my team has nice games occasionally and I think this might be Larry Nance's nice game he has a lot of a lot of rebounds. I would pass it out to him, but I'm afraid I can't shoot with him. Oh. Just as I compliment him, he, he turns it over. Nice game for Larry Nance. For his standards, because he has six points and four rebounds and like a, at least two blocks or something like that. So that's a good stat line for him. See Randall, that nice pick and roll action. It's always gonna always gonna pay off in a bucket for the most part, because that's it's kinda OP in 2K. We're playing Larry Nance. This is this is Larry. I should just title this video Larry Nance Breakout Game because that's what it seems to be. Dwight Howard shooting <laughs> Okay we'll give Dwight Howard those shots every day. Who's gonna get that? Larry Nance. <laughs> what why is he so good? Maybe I just needed to give him playing time because I gave him playing time and he's he's starting to perform. I'm eager to see how many minutes he's gotten at the end of the game when we look at the box score. Hopefully we win this because it's looking like that right now. We can go to the second round, go against the Clippers. It's going to be a nice battle of the Staples Center, battle of L.A. It's going to be very interesting. We're only up by five, though. So we got to be very careful in how we play the rest of this game. Kobe, that was a good open look. Kobe drains it. Here we go, Larry Nance. Can you pull it off again? Oh my goodness! This guy—he never used. To... I don't. I'm clapping for you, man, because I remember the regular first season of this Lakers. My GM. This guy was absolutely useless. I was eager to trade him too, but he's been dunking on people, catching lobs this season, or at least this game. Like I said, never gave Larry Nance minutes in the second season. Because in the first season, he just wasn't productive with us. But in this one playoff game, he's been getting some uh, shine here. Oh, he wasn't able to catch that. It would have been nice if he did. Got 30 seconds left. We really... This is a vital block. Oh, no. Why? Why did we do that? James Harden misses, though. He misses. We want to pass to Kobe. We don't need to take any stupid shots. The ball needs to be in Kobe's hand. You don't. No stupid shots. None whatsoever. Oh. Got. We're going to take a stupid shot. That wasn't that stupid. That should have really made it. Oh boy. No, no. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my goodness. James Harden. I, I, I would assume that James Harden missed a wide open three. And I think that that sealed the deal. I don't know. I'm I'm terrible at <laughs> last minute stuff. Beyond bow shooting free throws. And I think we're safe. We're safe and we advance to the second round in the playoffs to go against the Clippers. I cannot wait. One for two from the three. And he really missed that that big open three-point shot at the end to gain the lead by one. Talk about not clutch. 
He carried his teams in points, but talk about not being Kobe Clutch. That's for sure. Jeremy Lin. Where is Larry Nance, the top of the board? This guy had an amazing game. Like I said, two blocks, five rebounds, 15 points, two assists, two turnovers. But this was an amazing game for Larry Nance Jr. And here's hoping. I don't, I don't want to make him a focal point of this team, especially in the playoffs. But he really had an amazing game against the Rockets. And we saw that, so we gave him the minutes to show what he got. And he got 15 points in 15 minutes. So that's really good stat line, in my opinion. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're going against the Clippers next.